Welcome back for another Amazon Live. I have, as promised, some really incredible jeans from Amazon. I said in my last live, but I feel like those are one of the hardest items to shop for because, well, I mean, they're hard to shop for in general because we are all built very differently. And, um, shopping for them online gives that extra added layer of difficulty so i'm trying to make it as easy as possible for you and share some of the best amazon jeans that i have come across a few of these are new a few i have had and worn forever and i love them and um another thing that i feel like we run into when we shop for jean jeans on Amazon is quality and it is like my mission in life to bring you the best highest quality Amazon fashion finds of any type let alone jeans so I wanted to make sure that all of these were top tier highest quality luxury like something you would find at a high-end retailer and that is exactly what I have narrowed my list down to here. And so let's go ahead and dive right into it. So um, I recently got these and I even opened or unboxed these on my last Amazon Live and I wasn't sure how I would feel about them. The material is a little bit thin, um, definitely it's good for movement and I feel like after putting them on I feel like the material is actually perfect for the style and fit that they are because they are more relaxed they're more loose they're more flowy so I feel like the material really actually um, contributed to the overall aesthetic of the pants Whereas when I first opened them, all I could do was feel it and it is definitely a thinner denim. Uh, but I really like the color of these. I like that they have the unique uh, detail to them. They have kind of like that seamed rouging here on the front and then the back has this cute little like half belt. And I feel like it gives it a little something extra and really sets it apart from your typical wide leg jean, which is what these are. Um, another thing, another little detail that I really like about it is the thicker hem down at the bottom. I think anytime you have um, a, a thicker hemline down um, at the bottom, it really can elevate the piece and really elevates the overall look. And I'm really, really loving the, uh, well, actually we'll get into that with the a different pair of jeans but these are a great pair if you are interested in how to style them I just shared an outfit to my Amazon storefront if you follow me you can go check it out on there or you can click the follow button and then you will be able to see all of my outfit ideas style tips and all of the amazing Amazon fashion finds that I share on there but if you are looking for a good pair of truly wide leg jeans, because these are wide pretty much from the waist down, there is no, um, yes, Wendy, they, I would say that they run true to size. I ordered a four in them and they fit perfectly, exactly how they were supposed to. But if you are wanting something a little bit more on the fitted side, then you may want to size down. Last I checked, they were out of out of stock in the four, um, and I didn't see a two option. So I don't know like where you are on the sizing scale, but last I saw, those two were um, out. Uh, hopefully, they will restock soon because I absolutely love these jeans. Okay, so um, like I said, true wide leg jeans and they looked great with heels by the way I don't know if you ladies are heel lovers like me but they looked wonderful with heels okay so moving on to Sorry. <laughs> that's okay you can come get it my son is trying to get his VR headset right now okay so moving on to this pair of blank NYC jeans. It's so funny because the description of the jeans 
on the listing shows them as a slim straight leg, but they definitely are not. <laughs> they are more fitted like around the hips and around the waist area up here, but the um, leg definitely tapers off and is more of a wide leg, uh, I would say, rather than a slim or a straight leg. Even the picture is a little bit, <laughs> is a little bit, uh, um, what's the word I'm looking for? It, it doesn't look like it does in the picture. And I, I'm actually glad with the way that they turned out. I would have been fine if they were the slim straight leg too, but I actually really love these so much more than what I would have liked in the, from what I saw in the picture and on the listing. So, um, as you can see, they are a fairly wide bottom, but they fit very well. I do always recommend sizing down in the Blink NYC jeans. I have another pair that I'll be sharing as well. And I think that um, every, I usually, I'm normally like a 26 and I usually end up going down to a 25 in these, but they are a beautiful, like you can see, <laughs> I haven't washed them since I worn them last, you can see. Um, they're a beautiful like cream color, which I feel like is perfect for the fall color palettes, um, all the neutral fall colors. And then as we move into winter, you can wear it with like a cute white sweater for like a winter whites kind of outfit. But these were probably my favorite jeans that I have found in a really long time. I also have these on my storefront as well so you can go and see kind of how I styled them actually I think I wore them with a bodysuit from this brand um, for like a very simple effortless kind of look but amazing jeans excellent quality love the fit of them okay no six on those wide leg think I'll risk the four. Yeah, you can always try it. And then um, because they are a little bit more loose and flowy, then you can, you know, see um, if those are a good fit for you or not. Uh, there isn't any stretch in the materials, so you don't have to worry about them getting too, you know, stretched out or anything. But that's also a factor whenever it comes to sizing down as well. Okay, so my other blank NYC jeans, these are my most worn jeans of all time ever. I have them in this lighter denim color, and I also have them in the darker denim. And by the way, ladies, I don't know if you already knew this or not, but if you are wanting to wear your jeans for like a business casual or more formal look, always go with the darker denim it's more elevated um and definitely a little considered a little bit more dressy than lighter denim but i love the color of this denim i feel like it's perfect to go with black white and really all the colors that i usually wear but my favorite aspect about the jeans other than the fit because they are fairly snug they have kind of like a skinny jean fit all the way down until you get to the hem. And then it has a raw hemline, meaning no actual like um, sewing or anything like that. And the split hem detail, I love. Again, because I wear a lot of heels, I love this look with heels. It really is a great way to like show off your shoe. Um, these have it as well, but these do have the sewn hemline, so it's not like a raw, uh, hemline or anything like that, but still the split hem detail. And I think I just shared both of these on my storefront so you can kind of get a feel for how they fit and what they look like on um, if you go there. Okay, so, and again, Blank NYC, I almost always size down. Speaking of Blank NYC, we'll just We'll finish out the jeans that I have from that brand because it's such a good jean brand. Like, I don't know how it took me up until last year to uh, find that brand on Amazon. And they actually have a lot of really good layers too, like a lot of really good uh, faux leather jackets and things like that for 
transitioning into fall and winter style. So I highly recommend them. Everything I bought from them, I have loved. It's one of my favorite brands to shop here on Amazon. Okay, so these have a really fun kind of bootleg or flare fit. I would say a mini flare, it's not too bad, but it's definitely a little bit more tapered than your typical boot cut jean. But I love the feel of this denim. Like words cannot even describe how incredible a quality this denim is. You can see here it has quite a bit of stretch to it. So it definitely allows for movement and it's a beautiful white color. One thing you do have to be cautious or aware of whenever you are wearing white is the undergarments that you wear with it. So keep that in mind. I always opt for like a skin color um, undergarment or something that is lighter so that it's not showing through. But overall, the quality of these are incredible. I love the way that they fit and they're perfect right now, especially because we are heading into fall and boot season. So um, the bootleg or the mini flare is the perfect leg for that. All right, so maybe you, I'm sure that everyone has heard of Levi's by this point. One of the best jean brands to own, to shop. They have such a good variety and variation. They literally have jeans for everybody. And that has been one of my go-tos to shop. One thing that I love about Levi's on Amazon is that they're actually usually less than they are if you were to go and buy the same exact pair at a retail store. So always, um, if you're like me and you're curious, you can go and check the, and compare the price to see what they would cost at like a Nordstrom versus what you're paying for on Amazon. And I promise you, almost always, it will be less on Amazon. Okay, so I'm not sure if they have like a partnership or a deal or, or what that looks like, but I am grateful because anytime I buy jeans, I already know that I'm getting the best deal possible. Okay, so Levi's. Um, I always opt for their high waist. I never do like the mid rise or, and I will never wear low rise again. That. Like, I feel like once you are a mom, that ship has sailed, or at least for me, but I love their high rise. They hit me right at my belly button um, and really are very flattering to, I think, any, any woman's body because it, A, creates a good outfit proportion when it comes to, like, tops and bottoms, but B, also because it's just more figure flattering especially when you have the waistline going around the smallest part of your waist. Um, it's just, which is usually like right at your belly button or right above. It's just the, the best look overall. So I usually opt for their high waist. These are their wedgie icon fit jeans. And I like them because they are very, I feel like they are, they are kind of like a true slim straight jean. So they're a great alternative if you're kind of wanting to get away from the skinny jeans. Oh my gosh, you guys, my kids are home from school today for, I don't even know why they have the day off. I think it's like a teacher grading day and I have one of them texting me and one of them coming in to get their virtual reality headset out of my office. I don't know why I decided to do a live stream with both of them here, but Anyways, I'm sure you, if you all have kids at home, you can relate. But I like these because they're a really good alternative to the skinny jeans or the typical skinny jeans that we have seen in the past. They still have a really good uh, fitted style around the hips, around the thighs, and around the waist. Um, and then the, the bottom uh, pant leg itself is not very, you can see it's not very wide and it definitely has more of like that straight fit to it. I love to wear these with heels and I love to wear these with boots. Something to keep in mind when you are wearing your jeans with boots is that A, if they're not going over the boot, like your pant leg or your jean leg is not going over the boot, it has to go into the boot. 
So you need to keep that in mind and you don't want anything too bulky or bulgy. And that's why I like a pant leg like this for um, tucking into the boot. Or I should add another option for the boot is that you can actually roll your jeans up so that if you have like an ankle boot or something along those lines, you can have your pant leg hit right at the top of where the ankle boot starts. So I love the wedgie fit so much that I actually bought it in quite a few denim colors. I have another denim as well, but I like this one because it's more of a warm denim and it goes with more of like the neutral color palette that I tend to wear. But I also have it um, in a lighter denim and then I also have this black denim as well. And I think I talked about these before on my last Amazon Live. I really like that it's more of like a faded black denim because I usually wear it with like a black top and it creates more of like that tonal look with a little bit of contrast between like the really dark black top and then the more uh, faded black jeans. So little, if you're interested in wearing like a monochromatic look that has more of a tonal aspect to it with the dark, the darker, <laughs> the darker color versus the more faded color, I guess. I'm not explaining that correctly, but anyways, we're moving on because we have two more jeans left and I want to get this done before my kids can manage to interrupt me any more. Okay, let's see. Oh, actually, I want to share these. I don't think that they have them in the exact color anymore, but I really, really do like these. Oh, wait, no. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> I don't know what I did with them. I guess I didn't pull them out. Um, I like them because they're, they also have kind of like a more modern or current fit to the actual um, skinny jeans. They're not like skin tight all the way from the top to the bottom, like what we've seen before in the past, but they're still, I think that they're a really good alternative or option for a more modern and skinny fit. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Oh, looks like I did not link the last white denim pair that I had to share, but that's okay. So I finally discovered my favorite pair of, my favorite style of jeans, and that is the trouser fit. That, I, I don't know why it took me all of these years, like I am in my mid thirties, and it took me all of these years to find that there was even such thing as a trouser style jean, but I absolutely love them because they're high waisted and because they have the detail like the thicker hemline down at the bottom. And then they have uh, the fit where they're usually a little bit more snug around the waist, the hips and the thighs, but they taper out at the bottom into more of like that wide leg. So they're not as baggy at the top as your typical wide leg jean would be and it gives it a more elevated look in my opinion and a great way to really elongate your legs. If you have shorter legs or you are on the shorter side, then definitely give the trouser jeans a try. They have this in a few different colors, but I went ahead and did black denim because I rarely ever wear blue denim. It's usually either white denim or black denim. I don't know why it's I don't know it's a personal preference I think but I loved the way that these fit they have the perfect amount of stretch to them let me see if I can kind of show you a little bit about the stretch really good stretch to them so they're definitely going to move with you as you wear them and then they have um you know some really cute detail again at the top they've got the belt They've got the buttons, um, they've got this, the seam down in the front and the thicker hemline as well. And I would say these were the, I'm 5'5 five five and my legs are fairly long and these were the perfect length to wear with a pair of heels. So they would be great with heels, with boots, um, especially now that we're entering fall but I will likely go back and order these in the other denim color that they had available because I love them that much and I love the way that they fit. And I am going to be on the hunt for some more 
trouser style jeans from Amazon. It's my new favorite and I have made it, <laughs> I have committed myself to finding some more trouser style jeans to incorporate into my wardrobe, which means that as soon as I find a pair that I love, I will of course share them with you because that is, I shared in my last Amazon live, but it truly brings me joy to share like high quality Amazon fashion finds. I don't want you to have to like go return something because the quality wasn't there because of something that I recommended. So I really try my best to curate and like I order a ton from Amazon and I share a less than half of it with you because I am a stickler about quality. I have very high standards. I assume you do as well. And so whenever I share something, I want to make sure that it is, it is exceeding expectations. So anyways, thank you for hanging out with me on this Amazon live. I have uh, quite a few quite a few boxes that I'm getting ready to unbox right now, literally as soon as I hop off, um, that I'll be sharing and incorporating in my, in my Amazon live next week. Um, so if you are new and you haven't already, I would, I hope that you will hit that follow button, hang out with me. That also gives you access to my previous Amazon lives and all of my outfit ideas and inspiration that I share on my Amazon on my Amazon storefront as well. Okay, ladies, I will see you all next week.